It's not your job to convince them, but what would you say to you know guys that, that played at Kentucky you know 50, 60 years ago who who go, hey, I didn't get much. Uh, you know, why are these guys getting it now? Hey, I mean, I don't make the rules. You know, I'm just trying to make sure that <laughs> the rules that are in place for me uh, that I'm taking advantage of it. You know, but uh, it's it's a great opportunity for all of us, and I think to be a part of this first wave of student athletes to kind of feel this process out has has been really really exciting but at the same time it's kind of made us take a deeper look into it than maybe some guys might in in five ten years when there's more of a kind of stable environment uh that people have gotten used to but it's been fun as, as a business guy myself i mean i if anything i've used it as a way to educate myself in all these different types of areas and, and learn how to um just create a brand for myself and make sure that everything i'm doing on the social side more importantly on the field and with the team is in line and puts me in a great position to capitalize on the opportunities. And Jim, yeah, Jim Caval, you know what I liked about Will's answer? It was spoken like a true quarterback. I'm, uh, hey, I'm in charge of this huddle. You listen to me, uh, and this is the way it goes, right? Well, yeah, and you know the thing is, Paul, is for the the old school folks. I think the the best thing for them to understand is this: guys like Will and so many other athletes are now doing what they usually would wait to start doing after they're done playing, which is start to think about themselves more than an athlete, start to think about how they can open themselves up um, and really use the education they get in college to, to put it to work and learn how to network and learn how to find opportunities to make money with their name, image, and likeness, that it, it, it's making them better as human beings. It's preparing them even more for life after sports.